Hello everyone and thank you for coming back to my video channel and that is Deb Chanel's for this world. Woo, we got a must-see video here. It's explosive. I couldn't even think of a song to sing. I thought about singing Rick James and Tina Marie. Fire, baby. But honey, uh-uh, I can't do that. I can't do it. Let me just get right on into it, okay? They saying Nene over there spitting on Kenya Moore. <laughs> Now, you know, that's a downright whooping, ass whooping, country whooping, girl, pull out the frame type of whooping. How you going to go try to fix your mouth, secrete some um, saliva, get it back in your throat and get ready to piss it out like that through your mouth? Are you kidding me? It's time for y'all to sound the alarm and speak your mind on this. That is just unsanitary in all the ways of saying uncleanness. I know Nene didn't do this. She couldn't have done it. But if it wasn't true, they wouldn't put it in the article. They wouldn't put it on my social media feed. This article comes from Love B. Scott, okay? And she's a reputable, uh, um, reputable blogging source for the ATL, okay? And in New York and in wherever you want to take part of her. I don't think she stays in Atlanta. She might be in New York or California somewhere. But her streaming, her podcast, her uh, videos she makes, and her um, blogging site she has, she's pretty reputable. Or he's pretty reputable, however you see it. I don't know how he gets down, whether he considers himself a man and just looks like a woman or vice versa. Okay? But I got the respect. I got to give respect, honey. He brought an exclusive, all right, saying Nene Leakes tried to spit on Kenya Moore during a massive fight over her friendship with Mark Daly. Okay, so, you know, if you caught my first video today prior to this one, I talked a little bit about how Mark went behind Kenya's back. Yes, yes, that's a new tea uh, for coffee for some of us country folks, such as myself, or some wine, or any of your bo uh, bottle, you bring your wine. Bring your own bottle over here to the channel, okay? To the family affair, over to the house, the crib. You know what I'm saying? We just sit and, and um talk about different subjects and stuff. But I put a I, I put out a video earlier today, or I could say 30 minutes ago, and I was giving y'all the 411, the hot substance over there that was boiling over like lava coming from a volcano. Okay, I was like, what in the world is smart daily? Can you soon to be as husband over there chit chatting? This ain't a Greg and I mean I'm sorry. It's it's not a Peter Thomas and um Cynthia Bailey thing. Okay, they have no rights to be in each other's company because Nene don't like his wife or soon to be ex wife, and I'm sure she said some unflattering things to her husband, soon to be ex husband, about Nene. So why would he be over there in the leaks camp? You got to check the video out. Okay, I give you the 411. But let's get on into this article. Now, I can see why they would be fighting because if anybody attempted to try to spit on me, I'm already going for the throat, the neck, the stomach, the private vagina part. Would have, you know, put my foot up there and then be able to do that uh, crunch your back type of uh, Stance when they're in wrestling. Y'all know what I'm talking about. When you get them, they already bent up. When you just break them by the back with your elbows. <laughs> and then kick them back up with an uppercut. Woo, child. Don't, don't put no saliva. No type of bodily fluids on me. Okay? Unless I'm asking you to do it. Woo, Lord have mercy. But okay, the article, you know, it's just uh, strictly red. Nene Leakes tried to spit on Kenya Moore during a massive fight over her friendship with Mark Daly. Let's get on into it, all right? It's the Kenya Moore and Nene Leakes are back at odds. Sources who overheard the two fighting during the finale, which was taped in Atlanta. Okay, where else would it be taped? It's called the Atlanta Housewives. Uh, duh. Going back to the article. Last week, exclusively, tells lovebscott.com that Kenya and Nene got into a major fight while they were in Athens, Greece, over Nene's relationship with Mark Daly. Now, that is to, um, that is just something to behold. I never knew they were friends, okay? Never knew, never knew, never knew. But look at, look at, look at, here comes Cookie with the, the coffee being poured, okay? 
And I'm like, where's the sugar? Where's the cream? Where's the sugar? Where's the cream? And where can I sit down? Because it's going to take me a while to get back up because I'm just divulged in this whole story. Okay? Keep reading. I will. It says, here's what allegedly went down. Can you confront a nini after hearing that she's been talking to Ma behind her back? Mm. Things that escalated quickly. With Nene telling Kenya that Mark said he doesn't even like her. Why he married the woman? Was it for pay? Was it for pay for hire to um Kenya? Cause see, that's what I've always assumed that you paid him for services. And once services was rendered, he had to bounce on you, but you didn't really want to let him go at the time. Okay. Woo-wee. Going back to the article, it said, um, Things escalated quickly with Nene telling Kenya that Ma said he didn't even like her. He didn't like her from day one. Okay. Nene continued to throw out different things. She and Greg were allegedly told by Mark as their fight got more intense. All right now. That's when, according to our sources, Nene began to make a hawking. You know that. <laughs> you know that kind of know <laughs> You know, you know that kind. When you got something stuck in your throat, it's that uh, mucus, mucus that has drained from your sinus or in your head, and it came down through your, your throat and traveling. It's just not letting you swallow it, so you got to spit it back up, it's like you're getting choked with something. Y'all know how it is. But yeah, that howling sound, as if she was preparing to spit in King's direction. Now you know Nene need her ass whooped. Yes, you do, allegedly. But you know them fighting. That's fighting time right there. When you gonna talk, you gonna put some bodily fluids coming out your body. And I don't know if you got every disease under the sun. I ain't tested your blood lately. Okay. Uh uh-uh. uh. We need to do a DNA test or some type of uh, disease control test to see if you spit on me and I ain't got time to break you down like we in a wrestling ring match or something to that effect. Somebody better get me some uh, antibiotics because I don't think something ain't clean in the milk. You know what I'm saying? They ain't going to be spitting on folks. That's just ain't sanitary. Okay. But anyway, we're going to move on from that situation. It said, we can't say for sure if spit actually flew. Ugh, that's just nasty, ain't it, y'all? But I was supposed to say that at least one cast member heard Nene say she was close to spitting on Kenya during their Athens argument at the final taping. Now, what in the world is going through Nene heads? Now, that's an assault charge. You, you, you assaulting somebody with your de- uh, body de- deadly uh, germs. You know what I'm saying? We don't know what you got. We don't know where you been. All right? You ain't even know better. Ooh, you thought you do knew better. You do better. But damn, Nene, you can't go spitting on somebody. That's just inhuman. Are you clone, baby? Are you clone? Because the human people don't go around doing that enough unless they know they have ass. For someone to get them ass whooping, okay? By appointment only, by appointment only. Okay, but then we go back to the article, because that was all my sidebar. To be crystal clear, the finale itself was taped in Atlanta, but during the final, the finale, the ladies had an argument about this argument, which happened in Athens. And I'm guessing Athens, Georgia, Nene's hometown. Don't know why they, I'm not again, it could have been Athens, Greece. Okay, let me get back. I'm in the wrong country. <laughs> But you know, that's 51 year olds, honey. We had it one minute, then we went lost our train of thought in the next couple of seconds. So stick with me, okay? But anyway, going back to the article, it says, as previously reported, Nene and Kenya got into a major altercation and nearly got physical with each other earlier this season during the cast trip to Toronto. Despite making up, things clearly took a turn for the worse. The Real Housewives of Atlanta. Uh, premieres November 3rd at 8 p.m. Okay, that was all short and sweet. Uh, Love B. Scott had put out on this interesting uh, turn of events on Kenya Moore, thinking she gonna let Nene Leak spit on her. Oh, that was some fighting there. Oh, that was fighting there. Oh, I wish I was a fly on the wall. But I'm sure somebody told Nene, you better suck that spit right back up and swallow it or spit it out on the ground. You ain't going out here spitting no folks. How are we going to put that to the people? The people ain't going to like it. The people are not going to like it, girl. They're going to probably say, you in that Uber driver mess again. You see, you done turned it. Oh, you done turned into a complete unhuman person. You're an animal. You're an animal, girl. That's how animals act. Act still alive. But anyway, that was my uh, take, my spiel, my perception on this article that was written out uh, by Lil B. Scott. Okay, if you don't believe me, you want to see it in black and white yourself, go on over to lilbscott.com. Okay, I'm pretty sure she got some other scandalous, salacious stories out there for you to partake of. 
also. But I just wanted to take this article from her, give her props and all of that jazz. And I want to bring it on my channel so y'all can speak your mind. Speak your mind. I know you probably just want to say, woo, woo. If that was me, woo, what I would do. Ooh, child. I know that's right. You know how folks be saying you don't got on their nerves so bad if you was on fire, you wouldn't spit on them. Woo, wee. <laughs> I tell you the truth, but that's all I have for this video. I'm gonna uh, wind it down. I'm gonna go on, you know, get on in that bed bed because I do got a real, real job. But see, this is supplemental income for me. I like making supplement income, income. And like I said, you all need to get a hustle too if y'all want to make that extra money. All right, because you gotta learn how to make ends meet. Yes, you do. If one job ain't fully taken care of, it you gotta. Swing and get another one, okay? And I choose to do this because I'm at home. So it's at my uh, stay-at-home job, okay? That's how you girl get down. But anyway, y'all know I'm asking for you all to share, like, and subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so. But continue to come over to my channel with the subscription, okay? Because you know I want you to subscribe because I'm trying to get to that 10,000 subs, okay, on my channel so we can blow up together, okay? But that's all my entertainment I had for tonight. Um, again, look at my videos, share my videos, like my videos, and subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already. Y'all have a great night. I'll see you next video. Bye-bye.